Hi, this is Dennis from USA-evote.com. Hey, today we're going to show you how to add a product to Merck by Amazon. Okay, I went through half a dozen videos already and they're showing the old format and if you look at the old format you can see hey, prices have changed and the procedure has changed and uh, I guess I'm gonna have to show you how to resize a picture too but this is actually pretty easy what I do is I've already got this pretty much saved up over here so I've got my uh, basic products already saved and I've got my write-up already saved and you just hit the save publish settings and it'll save a lot of this stuff for you already so you don't have to enter it in again and again and again but first thing you want to do is you want to hit select products very important all of these are going to be checked you want to uncheck all of them and you just want to go I'm just gonna go with a standard t-shirt and I'm gonna go with the uh, tank top on this one that's our basic product line uh, the reason for that is this standard t-shirt counts as one product and the tank top counts as another product we're only allowed uh, three submissions and ten products a day and for some reason their system here you just follow these instructions and you'll be okay now it says upload your artwork and people have a problem with that now uh, one of the things that we really need to do is to get into our products here and I'm sorry I'm a little bit behind over here I should have had this done already but what I want to do is get into find my products here and I've got all my pictures in one uh, folder for our website and our store we go into our t-shirts see I've got a uh, an Amazon one here and I just came up with a new design I got a PNG what I want to do is open up that PNG in uh, GIMP I use GIMP I run a Linux system GIMP is free you can run it in anything but this is gonna open up in GIMP and it takes just a second or two and it'll pop on up we've got other t-shirt designs that we have on uh, our store on USA evo.com I'm gonna enlarge this thing okay so here's my t-shirt design now I'm gonna go over simply go over to images because we are opened up a PNG and we want to look at the canvas size see this canvas size is uh, 3600 by 4200 what Merck is telling us is that we have to have a 4500 by 5400 easy numbers to remember are just reversed okay so we got 4500 we want to make sure this little chain thing is unlocked so we can change these individually and we go over to 5400 all right so now we've got this in it and it's showing this little picture up here it's gonna offset it to the right and down what we want to do is uh, we want to center it now that we've got it centered we got a 450x offset and a 600 typically I've been changing these to 100 but for some reason Merck seems to set their design down a little bit so I've been going with an offset of 10 and once I put in that offset of 10 you can see it puts it pretty close to the top <clears throat> and I do have some white area in there we're using a PNG so this is actually going to show up as a transparency and I don't know if this matters but I'm just going to resize all layers we're going to hit the resize 
and we're gonna see boy this thing increases okay this is the way Merck wants it this is the only way Merck will accept it now that we've got this on there we want to save as because I want to call this I call it an Amazon so I know these are resize and they're gonna fit on Amazon and I'm gonna put it in my Amazon folder and uh, I don't want to save it I made a mistake of course you're probably gonna make a mistake too now that we've got this we want to export it and GIMP we have to export it and it's gonna export it the default is gonna be a PNG and this is what you want to save it as is a PNG we go into our Amazon folder we're gonna put this in as an Amazon again and we're gonna save it as a PNG and we're gonna hit the export it'll take a little couple of seconds I just use the default everything shows up fine I've, I've had these t-shirts made I've ordered them I've washed them I'm print full <laughs> I'm not gonna make another video of that I've already got this one made but I had been having trouble with my microphone on here I'm not happy with it so I deleted that video but here we go now we can go back to as soon as I find this thing up over here we're gonna go back to Merck we're gonna hit the upload artwork now and we're gonna go in our Amazon folder and we're gonna take this one that we just created and we're gonna hit the open now you can see this this area up over here is is down a little bit from, from the neckline so we really don't want to offset it any further down we offset it any further down you're going to be tucking in your shirt and you're going to be covering up your cool design and you notice these things are already scaled down <clears throat> see i made this thing intentionally a little bit narrower for a tank top and they scaled it back down for a tank top so maybe you gotta make one set of artwork for a t-shirt one set of artwork for a tank top or something but we're all kind of learning this system we gotta we gotta remember that these systems these these programs are are made for people that are what do you call it i gotta get rid of this thing so if i switch over here and switch up back to merc it should be gone it's not going so I'm gonna get rid of them switch back to Merck okay so now we're only looking at this now what you want to do is you want to edit your details on here and when you edit your details you're gonna pick your colors I've already picked out my colors but there's other color choices that you can go through and and they're gonna light up they're gonna show your your shirt looking really cool and uh, you pick the colors you want you got to do this for both of them I've already got these colors chosen and you also want to adjust your price see we got this set at uh, the list price we're gonna make two dollars on this shirt we're gonna uh, cancel that we're gonna edit the details on this one and we're making two dollars and 21 cents on this one so the prices aren't that bad but they're a little bit more expensive than some places but you do have the coverage that Amazon gives you so we're only going to do the front if you're going to do a back design you can do a back design you want to check it out what I do when I put these on you see I got this this white lettering which shows up really great on on dark colors and I put a little you can't really see it but I put a dark blue border around this thing so when we go to a white t-shirt it'll look great too now when we go down here brand our brand is USA eVote get out the vote apparel 2020 series and here's the design title this one we gotta come up with a good design title uh if you don't think your one vote matters okay we could come up with it just a little catcher uh 
we're going to say get out the vote one vote matters this is this is more or less i'm just looking at this that that if somebody sees it and they want to search it again they can quickly search it on amazon and one vote matters will probably show up in a search among 20 million other t-shirts okay our key product features are get out the vote apparel from usa evolve if you put in a t-shirt or something like this you're going to have that little warning sign popping up you got to use the word apparel okay uh and this one you have to have at least 75 characters uh, make a stand in America by showing your support and we can just add in here that one vote matters this original USA e-vote design is new for 2020 uh, basically people are going to be looking at the t-shirt if they like it it's going to be cool I don't think this is really too important you don't have to go into an elaborate discussion or anything but you can fool around with these you can try adding a v-neck or something else and you're going to wind up running into all kinds of problems especially if it's your second or third one that you're adding in for a day I don't know how they exactly count products but you can only do three submissions a day. This is two, one for the t-shirt, one for the tank top. So you're kind of limited in what you can do for a day, but you gotta make sure this review is lit up. And you can see I've got like 10 color choices and stuff like that. I'm kind of feeling my way through this right now. We wanna make sure it's searchable. Uh, the save public set, publish settings I've already set, but the first time you do it, and you get in your little slogans and stuff up over here you want to save it and like I already showed you it it, it saves the the select products the button I pushed up here unselected a whole bunch of them we're just gonna deal with these two products and it saves the color selections too so they don't have to keep on doing that over and over again so they did put a little bit of thought into creating this system okay now that we got this all done we hit the review button and it goes through that uh, these products will be searchable, a quick review, and we're going to submit it. Simple. <clears throat> we get to look at that little thing spinning around here for a couple of seconds here before it pops up, and it's going to show me my products here. And once we get this products page opened up, it's actually the manage page, <clears throat> it's going to show that we got this one under review, we got this one under review, and these are live. All right, so that's it. Follow these instructions step by step. You can experiment later, but get the first one on, get your feet wet, get used to the way the system works, and leave some comments. Hit the follow me button. We're gonna be posting uh, different stores that you can uh, sell your t-shirts from. And we're going to be going through and keeping up with the updates as the Merck system changes. We're going to produce new videos. They're going to show you how to work around whatever changes they make. We know that when we're working on the internet, once we learn how to do something, somebody changes something, and then we got to learn it all over again. The learning curve can be pretty steep. Okay, have a great day and don't forget to share i want to see this thing all over facebook and all this other stuff and goodbye for now